<laughs> Sorry. Raphael. I mean, honestly. We can do this. Come on, Raphael. Keep it down. Let's be right now. We're back here with Fireman Three Houses, our verdant wind assassins only run. I have calmed down and emotionally recomposed myself since the last two episodes, which were a lot of emotions. Raphael made me cry. I got very angry on Happy's behalf. And now it's time to head around the monastery and talk to people. And we get to see what the influencer can do for us now that it is post skiddly do time skip. Hello, it's me, I'm here. Okay, good. As usual, I'm expecting this will split into two monastery days, and then I'm thinking about what we'll do next. A battle day seems in order here, but I doubt I'll do dividing the world then, because I think the uh, uh, required level or suggested level was 30 for that, and I still don't really feel like amazingly confident about that. And we have till um, the fifth month, I believe, and it's only January, so probably I'll just do the rare monster setting and then whatever else and then we'll head back to the monastery here and so maybe it'll be two episodes for the monastery day here and then one episode that's like the battles and then whatever doing extra monastery stuff here and then another episode that's like battles and then more supports or something i'm not sure well I'll see how to divide it all depends how long it takes for me to talk to everyone so let's begin with that right now oh i bet this will be bernie over here in uh her room how's it going friend <sighs> at last i return to my domain my lonely paradise my realm of exquisite solitude. How's that working out for you? Uh -huh. Professor? Is that, um, is that you? Think so. You, um, you didn't hear that just now, did you? I mean, pff, a whole monastery heard a friend. Sorry. Oh, forget you heard anything! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, and now we've unlocked advanced drills so all of our friendos can teach us uh, the various things that we may want to know. And uh, that'll be especially good for anyone who can teach us brawling, which I'm guessing is like Leone and then... Caspar and stuff because I uh, still want to get better brawling and most of my people who are actually in my party have better brawling than I Pond snail yum. Look at all the cats hanging out here. Wait, whose room is this? Uh, Ignatz on one side and Raphael on the other. Oh, they've got little cats together. That's adorable. Who is Hoppy's next door neighbor anyway? Oh, it's to do that's neat. Well, not anymore, I suppose. We have tons of activity points, and we're and we're no, the pressure is no longer on for us to recruit people, so we don't have to. I think we can spend them a lot more impulsively on like on whatever we kind of want to. Uh, especially anytime I see someone who can teach me brawling, because I want that damn healing focus. Ding darn it! Howdy. It's not just for my village that I'm fighting alongside you here, you know. It's also that Captain Gerald asked me, his first and greatest apprentice, <laughs> to look out for you. I thought we were also kind of friends, you know. But sure, it's a favor to my father. Of course, it wouldn't be enough just to keep you alive. It's my duty to make sure you win, too. <laughs> so do your best, Professor, and count on me to watch your back. Always and forever. Well, I count on you to watch my back. I don't really know where I was going with that. Oh, she can't teach me brawling. All she teaches is Lance. Interesting. Felix, maybe you can teach me brawling. A country with no king has no future. That's why I made my way here. Professor, don't let me down. Let's forge ahead. Yes, let's. Find me a worthy opponent to battle, and I'll be content. <laughs> I don't think he wants to talk about Dimitri. Ah, uh, you won't be doing any of the battling. Oh, he can't just be brawling. Thank you, Felix. Yes. This experience is critical. Yes. Hang on, Tick. So there's uh, so there's some rule, but like you're not allowed to teach them. They're not allowed to teach you it unless their skill in it is, uh, exceeds yours. So I just was in C, uh, B, a D plus brawling, and he was at. I guess something higher than that. Let's check. Yeah, he's at C+. Plus, so I guess he can continue to instruct me until that point. Which never stopped me, but... <laughs> oh, advanced sword tomorrow today. Oh, come on, let's do it. Claude! Claude, you got it, right? Oh, he might not, uh... Have enough damage on him to take them out. Well, he's got, like, crits and lethality. Go, go, go on, Claude! Give it a go! I believe in you! I didn't class him out of... Assassin, did I? No, I did. I did last episode, didn't I? Yeah, he's got sword fair. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, what was I worried about? He didn't have enough damage. <laughs> what am I talking about? <laughs> Yonk! And... <laughs> too easy. <laughs> <We're all> <laughs> We're so desperate, we're gonna have a fighting tournament for money and the enjoyment of others. Right, so he's got about a 50% chance on, <laughs> on on most of our friends here, so uh, all we have to do is heal him whenever he should uh, so fail one of those dodges, but he hasn't yet. Those are the quarterfinals, only two more missions. I don't think he can die now, even, because he's got like 100% chance to strike. Oh, 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 he could. Nah, he's fine. That was so freaky in close. 
I saw my life flash before my eyes. Yes! Well done, Cod! So Silver Sword Plus, which is something we were going to want at some point anyway. 300 Professor level. Oh yeah, that's right. They, those give you good Professor levels, so we probably do want to be uh, doing them lots. But also we have a lot of people who are not at max motivation here. Seems like everyone returned to 50% uh, motivation at the time skip, but that's not good enough for me. Especially guys, our teaching points are probably going to go up when we get this next level, which is going to be rather soon. Petra! Edelgard is controlling the Empire. She is putting the pressure on the Kingdom and Alliance. I felt this! Empire and religion are at open war. It will be... Difficult for us at first. Maybe we could just leave it at, at it will be difficult. But corrupt nobles are many. That means the common people will rebel and be joining our side. With you, Professor, the battle tides will, uh, will turn. I have certainty. Oh, likewise, with you on our side, we can't fail. Anything you could teach me that I would want to know? Oh, uh, flying. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad thing for me to have at some point. Uh, for my alert stance plus, I could go for that. Uh, any, any skills I'm willing to get rid of for that? I could probably pass up close counter or bow prowess, or maybe even health plus five in favor of alert stance. It would be pretty neat for me to have, I think. So Iris, I, I'm gonna carry on learning flying and brawling wherever I can. Howdy. Of House Gautier, and I'm fighting alongside a bunch of alliance people. I can just imagine my father's face contorted in anger, and the delightful words <laughs> he must have used to describe me. You seem a little pleased at the thought. I don't know how staying and fighting for. Or you just putting on a brave face. Sorry, Professor. I don't regret my decisions. I'm just thinking out loud, and I'm hoping I haven't made a big mistake. Hey, no problem. Take all the time to think that you need, aloud or otherwise. At least Felix will be happy to see you. <sighs> this person won't be, though. This is a lot of knights talking to Flane. Oh no, they're just like congregating a few feet from Flane. She's just eavesdropping. <gasps> Professor, I am so glad you were unharmed. Hey, likewise. You know, when some people started turning to dragons and people started falling off cliffs, not me, obviously, I got worried. No matter the path you walk, I will be with you every step of the way. Thanks, Flame. Anything you ask of me, I shall see it through. Okay. You saved my life, and I am in your debt. You could tone it down a little. You could teach me faith, which would be kind of just neat to get that third star finished, because it's going to bug me otherwise, but I don't actually need it for anything, so that's a bad idea. Howdy! In his search for her grace, the Archbishop, Seteth has visited churches all across the land. It served to demonstrate to the devout across Fodland. That the Church of Seros is still going <laughs> strong. In spite of that being kind of a lie. As a result, the faithful are not currently in a state of chaos. Good man, Sadith. Keep them all calm. I mean, I guess there are a lot of people returning to the monastery here. I shouldn't be so snide. I mean, like, a lot of people, actually. Tons of mages and, and knights and bishops and all kinds of stuff. Claude! Hey there, my friend. Nice it's work on that. The monastery was once in ruins. Sword tournament. Now it's downright bustling. Thanks to a little promise five years ago, our buddies have all gathered. And even the knights have returned. It's like we were all just waiting for you to awaken. Funny how that works, isn't it? And now, we're all going to band together against the Imperial Army. Let's give it a go, anyway. Go and talk to everyone if you can. There may be some who are still on the fence. Ah, you overheard Sylvain thinking aloud t t as well, did you? I can teach you to me. Oh, you can just be flying as well? Hells yeah. Alright, I should, I should save a few points because I probably want to do some meals. And get my, because I want to get my professor level 2 the next level before I go to the greenhouse. You get it, you get it. Okay. I'm thinking... Are you now? The lords have been at odds, so peace and prosperity have declined there as well. In particular, bandits have been appearing in large numbers near the Great Bridge of Murder. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Rumor has it that the Domain's lord, someone by the name of Acheron, is a completely ineffectual leader. Uh, you shouldn't believe everything you hear. I'm sure that he's a totally... No, I can't even pretend. No, he's totally useless. I'd be a better leader than him, and that's saying something. Look at the little doggy here, and you would with the doggy, and you're pretty doggy. Hi there, Daw. Father, you've made a new dog friend, have you? Well, I suppose you and Citri have decomposed more since the last time I was here. Perhaps, perhaps that's related. <laughs> ah, hi, yeah, still resting in the warm embrace of cherished memories, I see. Good, good. Can I feed the dog that's at your... I can. It's a playthid Rex. Here you go. Please don't eat my father's body. <laughs> there you go. Have yourself some treat as well. And some more three. And have another three. Way! Nice. Thank you. Ah, uh, I should be keeping some amount of fish around and stuff. Oh, right, because we've got we've got bait now. Hang on. Uh, when's our nearest next important fishing day? Uh, we'll have one. Ooh, we might want to do battle, battle, and then monastery in, in the way this is set up so that we can do uh, the, the fishing one. Or we could just buy more bait and then save it for the next festivals of fish and then just spend like three hours fishing then and get a bunch of golden fish. I think I'm going to do that actually, you know? I'm just going to keep buying bait and saving it up for our next festivals day. Hey there! During the Millennium Festival, 
The leaders of all territories were supposed to gather together and pledge perpetual peace. That's some irony right there. <laughs> now that hope has been dashed, thanks to the Emperor's actions. I don't know, that's all her fault. Oh, sorry, the Knights of Saros are just dressed in red. I was all confused about that before, but they just are. The kingdom is also vastly different than before. I guess we'll never return to the world as it was five years ago. Not that same world, but maybe we can make a better one. <laughs> one with less overpowered Pegasus Knights. Hey, Shamir. I'm more of a mercenary than a knight these days. I work to get paid. I never was too attached to Fodlan. I was considering leaving soon, but I might change my mind if you're around. Aw, thanks, Shamir. Figures you and Catherine would be hanging around together. In Lady Rhea's absence, I will follow you. That's what she would want me to do. Know that wherever you might lead us, I'll continue searching for Lady Rhea. Okie dokie. I just don't think you'll have good luck finding her over in Deirdre whenever we're over there. That's fine. Good, because I will not budge on that point. I didn't expect you would. Come back, Professor. Thank you. You can just be brawling, right? Yeah, let's go. Oh, I just said I should hang on. Aw, oh, damn it. <laughs> but that was a good one, at least. Hey, Catherine will probably be my primary brawling instructor because uh, she actually is at the point where she has healing focus, so she could probably teach me up to that point at least. Heck of a lot of people down in the dining hall and stuff here. Let's go chat. Oh, hello. This is terrible. Hey, I could use a hand. Recently, pirates have been raiding coastal towns in the Srang region. People say that they're attacking innocent civilians and sinking merchant ships. Think you can do something about that? No, but I will try. Lady Rail hasn't come back yet. No, no, and uh, don't ask when it will happen because. The answer will disappoint you. Hi, Raphael. Fine alongside you and everyone else is a dream come true, Professor. Well, you got some strange dreams. And don't worry about my little sis. Right now, she's back home helping out with the family business. Oh, neat. Good for her. I kind of figured I was going to be stuck going back and taking over for her. But thanks to you and Claude, I get to work on my dream of becoming a proper knight. Well, how, how does me and Claude have anything to do with your sister's business? <laughs> oh, I want to learn brawling from you as well, but I got to save a few points for meals. Annie. Members of the Knights tell me that Father left their ranks five years ago. Why? They say he announced he was returning to the kingdom, but nobody's heard from him since. And he didn't say anything to you? I haven't received word that he went back home to Mother. Where could he be? Where are you, Father? What? What? Where is he? I don't remember him showing up later on in this route. What's going on there? Oh no. Oh, we've got a Wyvern Knight on our uh, dying hall here. Sorry, I shouldn't interrupt you while you're eating. Caspar! Hey. Okay, so between Caspar, Raphael, Catherine, and... Uh, Felix, we've got tons of people who can teach us brawling. Hey, we'll be at the only focus in no time. What happened. Which? I the dragon? The Empire after Garrick Mock fell, so I started drifting across the kingdom and alliance. Then I just happened to run into our old class. So what? We came back to the monastery together. You're right, I don't believe that. <laughs> How did that go down? Morale meals today, you say? Thanks for enhanced shining with an ally. Nice. Um, okay, let's just. Oh yeah, but most of our people in our in our party here like this. As the people who are actually in our party party. Well, let's do Lawrence and Ignatz, why not? Why? Sorry, why not? <laughs> I did not expect much from the dining hall, but this does not disappoint. Wow. This food is a revelation. <laughs> I can't help but smile when I eat it. I don't know why I don't recognize that Lawrence quote. Have I just not taken him to meals that meant much? Ah, shucks. Actually, uh, what the smarter thing to do is that we could actually reach the uh, next professor level before the next day would be I'll do one more meal and then I'll have uh, Claude, I guess, uh, dunk on the sword tournament again. So, okay, Leone and Petra. Oh, uh, no, Petra doesn't need it. Ah, Leone and Happy. There we go. We're both into the Daphnos stew. Works for me. Minced poultry and onions boiled with salt. A simple recipe lets high-quality ingredients speak for themselves. Sounds dickety dang good. Hey, friends! Wow. This is all kinds of tasty. Good, 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 good. That good, looks good. delicious. Goddess, forgive me. I've just got to indulge. It is the dining hall. That is what it's for. <laughs> no problem there. Good, because we know that the uh, uh, training grounds give you 300 when you win, so... Probably even send Raphael in there and he'd do all right. I, I, I probably shouldn't mess around though, because we know that we know we're, we know pretty confidently that. Yeah, look at Dorothy is about B and sword. Uh, we know pretty confidently that Claude will win it, so I should probably just have him do it again. Go for it, lad. Although that said, we were getting some luck on the dodging so many times last time, so it could it could go a little more awry this time, but not enough to kill him, I don't think. Sorry, but I must. No point in healing just yet, because he won't. He basically has a zero percent chance to not take this one down, eighteen and eighteen. So he only risks taking the one attack from them, which wouldn't be enough to kill him. But he has, he's gotten hit by everything now. I, they didn't die, Claude. <laughs> it's a tr unless we're actually... Oh my god, are we actually killing people with these? Claude, no! Get out of there immediately! This is not the kind of sport. I thought this was a fun sporting event. Yo! <laughs> Finally got a dodge there. It's so funny the way they use their normal battle quotes for these. I can just imagine Raphael beating someone with this tournament and going, Sorry, it's gotta be like this. They all just treat it so seriously. 
they're all just like destructively competitive. Yonk! A fitting outcome. All right, that's with the semifinals. So we're at full health here. Um, good luck. Get yourself a lethality. That would be neat. Yeah. Oh, Claude. Okay, good. Nicely done. Have a lot of money for us as well. And Professor Level. Boosh! Up to A at last. So there's only one more level to go, folks, because I believe A plus is the is the max. Uh, instructing and explanation points both increased, and adjutants uh, have gone up to three, and recipe book for cooking together has expanded. I haven't done that in a while. Golly, that was a lot. There's tea! Free tea. Not the cat. I was looking to talk to you. I know, but I want to look at the recipe book. Ah, oh, whatever. Okay, fine. I guess not. There are a whole bunch of quests just sitting around here as well. Golly. I have a massive quest list by the end of this. Hmm. Miss Day? Hey there. I'm going to need some help. <laughs> Do you have time for... The fish seem skittish lately. It's said that every five years in the wake of a storm, a mystery fish appears and eats up all the other fish in the pond. I call it the big one. I thought it was just a legend, though. Catch the big one! <laughs> it's no legend! Well, oh, fine, I guess let's do that, even if we're uh, gonna save most of our bait for the rest of it. So they gave me herring bait, so I guess that implies that we want to probably be using that for this. So this... What? Is this the big one? I can't remember. Is it purple? Or is it rainbowy one that the big one is? Let's, uh... uh we'll, just, we'll just start by catching this one, I suppose. <laughs> Strange fish sound shadow makes it sound kind of like it could be the one. Hey, there you go! That was probably it, eh? <laughs> you got rid of the big one! <laughs> now the other fish can rest easy. Assuming fish rest. Anyway, nice work. Oh, sorry, the herring bait's the, re the reward. My mistake, I thought they gave that uh, to us for that. Oh, I gave them the folded meat? Wait, why would you, you get that? I was gonna eat that. Bugger. Hey, Dorothea. Professor. Oh, my. <laughs> It's so Just good to see you. Serenading these barrels, are you? These days, so many old friends seem to be disappearing. But you, you're here. Here I am. It's incredible to see you again after five years. Hey, likewise, nice earrings. I have a feeling <laughs> your name will go down in history. So legendary that people will not say it ever. Nice to see you again. Hello, Ace. Professor, I've given up on ever seeing you again. Where have you been hiding? Ah, uh, River. Anyway, now that we're reunited in the land of the living, I must fulfill my promise. To Captain General to keep me safe, is that it? Right, the promise. That's right. I promised <laughs> the captain I'd protect you in his stead. And now, I'll make good on my word. Good, I remember that right. Would've been really embarrassing if I went right, the promise, and he was just talking about something else. Ooh, we've got a, a DLC quest somewhere around here as well. Oh, Anna. Really now? Really? There's unrest everywhere these days. All of my fellow merchants seem to be endangered. Things go back to normal soon. People need more to smile about, aside from my great deals. I agree there. I'm not saying anything against your deals. Uh, let's see that quest. <laughs> oh, it's just another one of these. Did we actually even finish the last one? Or is it just, it expires during the time skip, I suppose. It's a giant shell, though. Hell yeah, I'll have that. Need a favor. Uh, well, sorry. So let me just squeeze past you there and take uh, this uh, tea. And, uh, sorry, what was that about a favor? I've got a favor to ask. I want to start a collection that chronicles the history of Fodlin, but I'm having trouble getting my hands on anything significant. Honestly, it might be easier to excavate an artifact rather than trying to find one for sale. You'll give me renown and gemstone beads for ancient coins for this. Hot diggity! Why not have a piece of the roof? Excavation complete. Here you go. Thanks. <laughs> Magnificent! Exactly what I was looking for! Clearly, I asked the right person for help. You sure did. I had access to a very broken monastery. This is... An arcane crystal! This is free?! No, I was about to use that. Thank you so much! Free samples! God, everyone's so nice in the marketplace today. What do you Oh, I didn't replenish my battalions at any point. Yeah, let's do that. They're, they're gotta be, they ought to be tired after that reunion at dawn. Especially Claude's. Oh, speaking of. Well, we can fuss with that when we're in, at to battle. Oh, sweet peach current. Hi, a gatekeeper! Professor, nothing to report. Good to hear. You know, it's such a thrill to be able to greet you like What a again. thrill. It's Hoppy and Gatekeeper today. The knights are searching, but they will not find Raya. What a fear in my heart. Even though it doesn't be. <laughs> uh, sorry, sorry, yes. <laughs> well in the battle five years ago, oh no! But I won't allow any enemies to get into this place again. I promise you that. Almost died as in you were like wounded, or? I'll be sure to. Well, for now I'll keep training so I can eventually feel confident that I can stop. Them. Ah, it's not so hard. You just bring out your commander and your house leader and just spam combat arts and 
don't fight the game and play the game interestingly at all, and then you win. Oh wow, this scaffolding wasn't here before. There was just all the cats here. The moral of the story, gatekeeper, is be boring like me. Ingrid. Professor, I have a proposal. Do ya? Who's the lucky gal? Uh, dude or dude, whatever, person. Why not go beyond the Knights of Saros? Instead, uniting with allies from all across Fodlan to fight for our cause. But what do you think you're here? Looking back, <laughs> it would have been best to ally with the kingdom and join forces against the Empire. But now the kingdom is not exactly... well... Hmm, double meaning there. It's, it's not exactly... Uh, well, um... But it's also not exactly well. Oh, the quest over here that I missed. Sorry. This is terrible. I feel like we just spoke to someone who said that. I need a favor. Some soldiers stationed at Fodland's Lock had abandoned their posts. They weren't what you'd call upstanding folks. It would be a real headache for us if they became bandits and started wreaking havoc in the towns. You want me to go beat up some people who forsook the army, thus making an example for anyone else who might decide that war isn't what they want to live for? Sounds like fun. We should remind them that war is good. I was actually taking a lot less time to talk to everyone in the monastery than I expected. Lawrence! Professor, I have written to my father to signal my intention to remain here. Not that I require his approval to do so. Of course not. There is not much for me to gain by returning to Alliance territory now. Yeah, especially not when your territory is right on the edge of the Great Bridge of Murden. There have been bandits running amok there, or didn't you hear? But by staying, not that that stopped me from going to the monastery. The course of events directly on the field of battle. Will you get along with the Alliance later? We will not be friends, but I will cooperate <laughs> with him as much as is necessary to secure victory. <laughs> he just, he's just like, I just wanted to get this. Let's get this out of the way up front. We're not friends. <laughs> You understand me? Don't worry, Lawrence, I got it. Did I pick up any lost items earlier that I missed? Uh, no. Good for me for not doing that. I guess. Hello. Hi. Hello there. Yes, hello. I can do for some all of your finest snails, please. How much black sand steel can I afford? Oh my god, a lot. Um, we probably don't need that much. How much do we have? That's not the storehouse. 31 will be alright. Oh, smithing stones, though. Let's, let's stack up on those. Yeah, it'll do. I think. Return soon, please. Just, just give me like that handful there. I'm not gonna count it. <laughs> it's hey, fine. Welcome. Hey, well, you can buy a wild game infinitely. Neat. Doesn't that give you like how much? Come do we have any wild game? I feel like that gave you like a lot of renown. Oh, and all these gifts as well, which we don't Come necessarily again. need loads of for the moment. Oh, I'm already at the next professor level, so I don't have to keep. It. I've been like avoiding the greenhouse. Like I don't want to go there until I have the next uh, professor level, so I don't mess it up. Hilda. Give me a run for my money. What has he done this time? I mean, he's dragged the knights into this. You ought to be careful, Professor. I mean, that was you. <laughs> I mean, you were like very on board with that. You too. Don't worry about me. I'm here because I want to be. Also, <laughs> because being around my big brother feels like a real chore. Especially as he's suddenly taken ill for like the past six years. Oh, you got two quests for me. Uh, supply hey, excuse run. Excuse me. Could you do me a favor? We're in dire need of more supplies. Can you help? Uh, you need the smithies? Uh, I, I want those, but I'll, I'll take them Excuse renown. Me. Could you do me a favor? I already said yes, Hilda. We're gathering flowers as quickly as we can, but we still don't have nearly enough. Do you think you can help us? The prettier, the better. Okay. I've got those uh, uh, smithing stones and black so sand steel for you. You're a sweetheart. Thanks, Professor. You did a nice job of procuring resources for us. And here's a little token of my appreciation. 2,000 gold and 200 renown. Cheers. I'm going to have so much renown from all these quests. We're going to be able to get all this influencer's new uh, features immediately. And flowers, you say. Oh, I've got... Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, just let me just have... Why don't you just have an entire bush? How does that strike you? That was not the right flower, was it? Oops. Oh, no. Sorry. I actually have to give it to you as a... a, a, a sorry. Do that. You. Eat. Yeah. You're sweet, thanks. <laughs> Wasn't meant to be a personal Thank gift, so it was because much. he's... You're a sweetheart. You're welcome. Claude says that flowers in the grave are as much for the living as they are for the dead. If the dead don't look so solemn, then neither will we. That's Claude for you. I was trying to brighten things up a little. Because you're right about that. The Morphous Magicor, hello, Dolly. That sounds like it would be really good for one of our mage people. What, just what is that like? Morphous Magic, Morphous Magicor. Morphous Magicor. Uh, it's requiring thing is C, so it's probably just not quite as strong as the Timotheus Magi core. It, or, like, it won't be by the end. Although it's got better res and charisma. No, sorry, it doesn't have better charisma. It's got better res. Both seem like they would be an interesting thing. We'll have to mess with our battalions later the next time we go to battle, because things have changed quite a bit in our, our, our gear, our skills, all of it. Hey, we yeah, have can go up as far as the third floor this time. No, that's neat. I lied, it might be, we might be able to take down this entire monster day in just this one episode. It's going much faster than I expected. 
I guess there are some fewer people since the time skip we've lost, because we've lost Dimitri, Dudu, Edelgard, Hubert, Ash is nowhere to be seen, Rhea is gone. It only sounds like a, a few, a fewer people, but I guess it's a lot more than that. Five years, it feels the like. Here have left this place for the town below. However, once they learn of our return, perhaps they'll come back. Hmm. I mean, it seems like a lot of people have already. I hope the monastery can return to normal someday. We'll see. That roof is just going to be, it's just going to be a long time to fix. I mean, look at those stained glass windows. I mean, those, those don't get replaced in a, in a heartbeat. Golly, I didn't realize quite how much the roof was missing. I thought it was just over there. Well. There's that. I wonder if anyone has any troubles at this time. There's one trouble. All we do is battle. The fighting never stops. And it's turning everyone's dispositions dour. Even the ladies. We should throw a banquet to lift everyone's spirit. Uh, good idea. I'll see what I can do. That seems like a pretty easy one. <laughs> just, just sure. Sounds like fun. Marianne, Marianne. My might, my might. Even with the church in shambles, we can still pray. Yes, mercifully not for what we were praying for five years ago. The goddess will surely hear our prayers. But still, I hope the church can return to its former beauty someday. We'll see. We can bring it there, Marianne. You and I, and the others. Mercy! Professor, you're here, Professor. Along with everyone from our old class. It's like we've gone back in time. <laughs> it's kind of like that. Except the Death Knight is actually around less, which is a good thing. When I think that I'll be around Sorry. you again, all of my sorrows just drift away. That's so sweet. Thank you. Let's do our best together. Mm, yes. I'll at least try not to hold anyone back. Oh, you could never. Let's work together for the common good, like we did five years ago. Indeed! I mean, you and I weren't really... Anyway, indeed! We're gonna have a lot of paralogs uh, beyond this point, I think, considering we have recruited uh, everyone who can be recruited. So we better we better try and keep that... that uh, do them as soon as we can. Uh, but even still, I'm not feeling confident about dividing the world just yet. Hey, Nuts! It's been fixed up quite a bit. But its battle scars aren't so easily erased. I guess they add some beauty to themselves, don't they? They, they speak to the history of the place. To think that a glorious cathedral with a thousand-year history would end up like this. I'll rebuild this place someday. This cathedral is the symbol of Fodlan. Maybe I should paint a picture of the beautiful cathedral of old. While well, I still remember what it looked like. I leave that choice to you. At least the people are still able to, like, pray here and stuff, even though there's just, like, mounds of rubble everywhere. <laughs> I completely did not do the greenhouse when we were over there. My mistake. All right, sorry, so you know how I said I wouldn't necessarily be able... Oh, we've got all five of our slots now. Sweet. You know, I said I wouldn't be able to harvest this for five years. I'm back! Ambrosia! Yes! Um, it was root vegetables. Uh, let's do three root and then two eastern, shall we? A yoink, yoink. And I've got the max, uh, uh I, can sp I can spread Pegasus dung now. Yes. Cost a bit of extra money, but we've got a lot extra. Mappy! Not seen you for five years! Eat a flower! Why don't you? I still haven't decided to do the shoes of the wind to. Maybe I'll just never give them to anyone. And then I don't have to be struck by choice paralysis anymore. It probably is going to be Claude by the end. He's just such a, so useful as a dodge tank that we want to get him in there. It's either like Claude or Leone. Like, it's going to be one of our one of our people who's very highly specialized. It'll be like Claude for his amazing dodge capability, Leone for her amazing crit capability, or Happy for her amazing tank capability. It'll probably be one of them three. Hold on. Cyril's apparently somewhere. Oh, I haven't, I've, I've still not been up to the top floor, have I? Oh my god, look, I have, there are so many people up here. Let's check the dormitory in the third floor first, just to see if there are any unnamed NPCs. Hanging around. Uh, no one here. How's about on the third floor? No one here, but maybe there'll be some some loot for us. Someone will have dropped a, a I don't know, a pocket protector that we can sell for 3,000 gold. Looks like a nope up there. But this is where we had that nice conversation with Claude earlier, so that's nice, I guess. It's interesting because the skies are all like yellow and spooky and, and foreboding in uh in the post time skip here. But th I guess the time, it's probably like before where the time will like advance if you wait around long enough. I'm not sure I've ever seen the what, the what the place looks like at evening and night in time skip. Anywho, to the second floor with us. Yeah, I knew there were still a lot of people we still had to talk to. Lenny! The promise was made five years ago, but I must say I'm rather impressed by how many of us managed to make it. Especially seeing as you weren't present for the promise. Personally, I only showed up because I hope to see you again, Professor. Thanks, Lenny. I've been with my family in the Empire until recently. I admit to feeling a little guilty betraying Her Majesty, but only a little. Now that we're <laughs> all together again, I suppose the fighting will begin soon. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, you missed out on the where the fighting has already begun, my friend. It's funny that Lysidia can't teach us anything because normally she would have magic, but our, our magic is better than hers because we had to train it up to recruit people. I've grown weary and impatient. These past five years, my hands have been bound. But now, 
I can finally take action with a clear goal. I'm grateful to you and to everyone. Well, hey, we're grateful to you, pal. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Um, and that goal is? Down with the Empire. Surely peace will soon follow if the Empire is overthrown. I hope so. And my parents can finally find peace themselves. Otherwise, well, it'll be real awkward that we're doing that. A noble goal, I said, yeah. In the rhetorical sense, not, not literally. Anyway. Oh. Well, I was just saying about the uh, time advancing. Apparently, I've spent long enough that it, that's, that's going to happen now. Hang on. I want to get to the third floor and see what the sky looks like now. Oh, wow. It's just a slightly more yellow. <laughs> or orange, I guess. It already looked like it was kind of dusk because of the way it was all for. I didn't feel like we'd spent that long here. Oh, I guess we were doing supports and stuff all last episode and all. Hey! Thankfully, it appears the records and equipment I need for my research have not been damaged. Ah, thankfully they avoided getting the roof blown out, this whole room. I am most curious, though. You say you were asleep for five whole years. Incredible. Mm-hmm. If we want to test that theory and see if it happened to anyone else, we could always throw someone else off a cliff. Perhaps this is another effect of your crest. I do look forward to investigating you in greater detail. Okay, Henrin. Uh, maybe later. I'll have to be content with observing you wherever you go, then. I cannot waste any opportunity. <laughs> okay. Okay, buddy. Okay. Manuela! Hey, my professor. You haven't changed a bit. I could say the same of you! At your age, I'd expect your whole demeanor to have changed greatly over five years. Tends not to happen when you go into a magic death coma. No, I suppose I haven't changed either, right? Thank you for noticing, by the way. Ah... <laughs> Just the two of us, forever young. <laughs> oh, let me have my fun. I didn't say anything. Plus, you're still plenty young, I, I think. Seth! Five long years. Hey, you've been working hard. You Harder than I gave you credit for earlier. It is a pleasure to see you again. Likewise! The Church of Seros will follow you from now on. But please do not abandon the search for Lady Rhea. Well, it goes hand in hand with our objectives. We take back a strategic position, then you and your friends get to search it for the next month. We don't know what the future will bring. Wherever she is. Rhea is doubtlessly waiting for you. Please do not let her down. I will try. Oh, both of us has a quest for us, right? Well, we'll be going to Abyss in a minute here. New items of stock at the shop. Hello! Elixirs can be sold, and I, I suppose that means uh, the concoctions are now the the now, now are infinite to be uh, purchased. Brave weapons are stocked now. Ooh, a whole bunch of battalions uh, have been added here. One with assault troop. Holy Knights of Saros sounds good. Index sword fighter sounds really good. That's the one that Rhea had on her. Oh man, these all, these all sound really dope. Group Lance Attack. I'm not sure I've ever seen that one. Got any other healing battalions. Heals for eight. Oh no. <laughs> Blessing. Affected allies can survive. Oh, okay. So it, it's like it's like a, an automatic miracle. That one. Flash Fire Arrows. Oh, neat. It's a, it's a, a row battalion. Poison Tactic Golden Deer Wyvern Co. Oh, sick. Yeah, we definitely want to be stocking up on some of these. These look like they're going to have really good stats and stuff. Like, this one's got plus three defense already. I wonder if maybe it would have even better than the one that we've got happy with by its max level. Oh, speaking of, this one's already at uh, four. Actually, let's go buy that for happy. Because four is what her, 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 her one has now when it's at max level, right? Oh, she might not be able to hold it. But oh, we can hit the battalion guild up when we're at the mission level, mission screen. I gotta not get distracted. But a lot of new and interesting looking battalions that we have been added. Uh, right, good. So the Cardinal's room with us. This is the first time we'll be able to actually go here in uh, this room. And, and someone's already lost something. Oh, it's a feather. <laughs> it was like January the first day we're allowed in here and someone had already left something behind in here. Cyril! Let's see. I don't know anything about rebuilding, but I can sure do my best to clean up the mess. I'm gonna keep Lady Rhea's room spotless so she can use it right away whenever she gets back. <laughs> good lad. You gotta find her, Professor. You just gotta. I'm gonna try, but also, I mean, she's not gonna be back for like a little bit. So you, you can like, you know, clean it once a month or whatever. I have lost my dominion. My nobility may seem like nothing more than a title, but I will never lose my noble heart. I will That's stop the guard, even if it costs me my life. Hey, keep that energy up, because it just might. <laughs> I have turned my blade it's hard. To now. I cannot go back on that decision. Professor. Do you think I chose the wrong path? I think only you can tell me that, buddy. But you and Edelgard surely were quite close. In a way. We'll find out soon enough. You are right. I know. To abyss with us! Like I say, I'm interested to see if this place has changed at all in terms of its design. I'm gonna guess it probably hasn't changed that much down here. In a lot of ways, except for the war. The war does impact them down here, but in a lot of ways it also doesn't. Nothing looks too different so far. How long has someone had their own room, like, up there? Neat. 
Professor. Hey! Hey you, listen up. I've got something to report. Uh, nice to see you too after five years. Nice to see you. Oh, oh, You're okay. Still alive. <laughs> it's been five whole years, hasn't it? Time flies when you're standing guard. Apparently. That's right. I've been here the whole time. Day in and day out. Not like I have anywhere else to be. Looks like the Knights of Saros have returned. I wonder if Mr. Backup is back too. That's nice. Uh, have they come back to see you yet? Why is... The person who has a quest for us, I guess that's Balthus there on the map, like, twitching up and down. Are you doing a little jig, Balthus? Hey, Consus! Oh, you have the look of someone relieved to see me. All right, guilty is charged. Before you ask, yes, my superior spellcraft is yours. It's your reward for waiting so patiently for me. Who was the one who waited patiently? Wait, you know I was, like, conked out for five years, right? It would help me a lot. Your quick acceptance of the truth is gratifying. But my assistance has a price. It does. I expect you to aid me in fulfilling my dream of restoring House Nouvelle. I'll give it a go. But like Cyril, I'm not sure about, like, actually rebuilding the physical place. Nice to see you again, Coco. I'm sure her her default uh, ending is just, She rebuilt out House Nouvelle. It was bigger and better than ever. Like if she doesn't isn't paired up with anyone. Oh, no. But I'll still be curious to see it. Hey there! A lot of folks cleared out once the fighting started. People are saying it was the church that used to keep order around here. But it's Yuri who's saving us from complete chaos. So I think that's more likely. Oh, you're still there sitting there and being judgmental, are you? What do you require? Well, what do you think about Claude and his excellent speed? Oh, yes. This one's growth is going quite well. There we go. Oh, we're running C? Hey! Since when? Now, let me see. Oh, me. Marvelous. This one should be proud of their growth. Thank you. How about Mercedes? Perhaps you'd have better luck with the animals of the monastery. Okay, something's never changed. Well. That is your sass level, not Mercedes. <laughs> Being a bad at fighting or something. Some of the ways here want organize the shadow library. Also want. Oh, it, it will like add um, more like all those little like lore books for them something. I definitely want that. Um, I haven't got quite enough renown for either of those yet. They cost more than I kind of thought. Did I already know it would cost this much, and I just wasn't preparing well for it? That sounds like me. But I can certainly give some stuff away so we can go see the waste here now, because I definitely want to do that. Both us! The past five years have been so chaotic, even the bounty hunters backed off. I kind of miss the chase. I think you should enjoy it not being there while you, while you can. I have family ties worth fighting for, so these muscles are up for grabs. Use me as you see fit, pal. Hey, whoa, we gotta work on the phrasing, my man. But then also, maybe we don't. I'm not sure about your motivation. I'm counting on you. You're a smart one. Just point me at a problem and I'll smash it up for you. There we are. If you're worried my skills have dulled from disuse, think I wasn't. Again. I've been fighting thieves to stay sharp. Oh, troubling. But also probably good for the people. Yeah, quest have you. Got a favor to ask. Seems some villagers out near Fodlum's throat have been having some trouble with thieves lately. Holst asked for help dealing with the problem. You mind coming along? Kill your uncles plus, sweet. Thought you said you were fighting thieves left and right, and that you wouldn't need help with it. But sure, I'll come. Let's go get that waste here unlocked. I want it. Uh, can we give anything away? Uh, for right. Uh, wait. Also, did you have anything new at the altar from our for for now and stuff? I think this is all mostly the same. Bolt axe, neat. Ooh, magic bow. Well, wait. We don't want to spend renown on it now. Our knuckles, so close. These days, <laughs> these only give these give such a paltry amount of renown. Um, a lot of northern Fodlin seeds I don't really rightly need at all. I'll just bring it down to two. Oh come on, when am I gonna plant anything other than ambrosia? Just get rid of them and you. Get rid of all the seeds that aren't the two that I'm using. I can buy them back if I need. Oh my god, the flower seeds give you so much renown. Golly, nice. And number steel. Um, yeah, we can give a bit of that away. We don't need quite that much. I'll give a thir three of those away. Mithril. We're doing many things that give me through all oh, that's three of those back. Uh, Woot Seal. I mean, I'm not going to use many brave weapons because they're friggin' heavy. I might just give it all. I don't think I'm. Yeah, that's. I think that's fair enough. Right. What I wanted to look at is so wild game easy tens. So that's not bad. Well, no, it's, it cost 500 per, did it? So that's not actually a, a, a brilliant exchange rate of gold to renown. I'm sure there's an optimal way somewhere to. There's something you can buy that does good, good renown that is cheap gold. Like, especially those flower seeds. That was like, what, 40 per or something ridiculous? Like 20 per? It was something good. And they didn't, they don't actually cost that much, I don't tend to think. Give some Wolverine off? Yeah, it's probably not a bad move. I'm not going to use it too often, I don't think. Uh, the animals don't care for the onions. They We can use them in meals, but... So I don't need to use tons, but I'll, I'll give a few. Cheers, statue. Let's go and lock that waist here. Boosh! And skadoosh! Help Abyss flourish! I'll just spend my 
popularity. A renowned astrologer has come with, and a new quest has been unlocked. Whoa! See you again soon. Want? Oh yeah, they've got the little crystal ball there. Um, not before I go talk to Yuri though, and uh, say just say hello. Get back quick and happy, of course. Oh, happy's the one who's got a quest for me. Finally, I've been waiting for so long. Really? I thought you might have died, but I didn't have anywhere else to go, so I stayed here. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'll think about forgiving you. <laughs> Thank you. I've been lonely. As you might have noticed, we've lost a few people down here. I did notice. Ditto up top. Quest you have. Use your help. A fortune teller recently set up shop in Abyss. If that sounds like something you'd be interested in, why not drop by? Seek out the ways you're said to be in Abyss. Perhaps you can offer insight into getting to know your allies. Okay. <laughs> sure. Yuri. Oh, friend. <laughs> It's been a while, hasn't it? It has. Are you really so surprised to see me here? Nah. Dude, your hair is, like, long and cool. <laughs> I flew here just as soon as I heard you were alive. I care more than you may realize. Where were you? I'm happy you came. Who are you now? <laughs> I will admit, hearing <laughs> that does make my heart flutter a bit. It shows a bit on your face, I'm sorry to admit. <laughs> so long as our efforts are aligned, I'll happily work alongside you. Glad to hear it. Happy! Happy Yuri Bird's back! Time to dumpster dive, and then let's finally see what this uh, way here is about. Getting to know your allies better. But first, a rusted sword and iron gauntlets and an iron axe. Oh my god! You get more... Oh, right, you get more as the renown goes up. Is that is that a thing? I don't need this other shield on right now. Uh, rusted sword. Let's see. Uh, check all the rusted swords I have and see. <laughs> Not the one I gave to <laughs> Coco. Oh, just another one of these, I guess. As can be forged into... Uh... An iron sword. I don't. Did I already say that? Um, it was a little, it's a bit of a shame you can't give um, weapons for renown, but I guess you can sell them for money. Oh right, I guess I guess it's because it would be hard to grade it considering they have variable durability. We can always sell them for money that we can use to buy produce that we can uh, give off and stuff. All right, I'm excited. What's going on with the why? Do we have the two kids from The Shining in in your room here? Um, hello. My name is Hoppy, and um, uh. I, I hear you opened up a business recently. Let's see, we got books, books, a big old cauldron, a globe. Are we planning a trip somewhere? Hi. Why, hello there. Give some of your renown to the Wayseer and she can tell you about the bonds between your allies. Strength and bond and analyze the perspective relationship between the selected pair and boost their support points. Does not work on pairs who are already very close. Connect fates. Or see the destinies of a deeply bonded parent and either entwine them together or separate them from one another. So I can I can basically choose if they get an ending together. Is that the idea? Oh my. That's kind of cute. Um, I mean, I kind of don't mind. Oh, spend ten thousand renown. Screw that. Okay, so you can you can just you spend renown to buy support points and then spend a, a stupid amount to guarantee they have an ending together. Or does that like raise their support points even more to like make them like, like to to a level beyond what you can normally do to make like uh to give them like superpowers in combat or whatever? That's cool. That's that's a neat system. Even though I uh I'm th there's no way in hell I'm spending ten thousand just to get an ending I want for one of them. I need that renown for other stuff. Come Gosh, heck it. Now. Oh, I will. Don't worry. Just as soon as I need to mess with my friends' relationships and play a matchmaker a little bit more. Uh, happy? <clears throat> we shouldn't go back there. P pretty scary, pretty scary stuff there. Thanks for giving me a hand. So, you talked to the Waste here, huh? That kind of thing's not really for me. If she told me something good, I'd get my hopes up, and if she told me something bad, I'd get upset. But I'm glad you got something out of it. Thank you! And thank you for the tea and extra renown as well! I'm glad we tried, fortune telling happy. I think I'm with you there. I, the, the less I know, the better. Heck yeah, we got a lot of renown for that. Though. We could almost get the, the Shadow Library now if we uh, were so desirous. But we'll get a bunch of renown from doing some uh, missions soon enough. Because we've got two battle missions to do, which I guess we'll be spending uh, part of this day doing. We'll do one rare monster and then one battle mission. Next time on uh, Fire Moon Three Houses, our Verdant Wind Assassins Only Run, because that is all the time we have for this monster day. But it went by a lot faster than I thought, and that was that's some stellar progress we got all around, uh, my friends. So next episode, I suppose we'll just be doing, maybe we might even be able to just cleave through all three of the other free days in this uh, month, uh, next episode, and then we'll be able to move on to the battle mission, uh, the story mission, the month after, the episode after. That would be kind of exciting. It should be a, just a lot of grunt work and grinding uh, that we're doing next episode, but in a good way, because we'll have a lot of, uh, we'll be able to get masteries for certain people. Leone's basically almost, or no, she, she Leone did make it, didn't she? To mastery of assassin. I went the absolute longest way I could possibly do to get to Leone. Uh, yeah, she's got masteries. So we'll, we'll be able to set up all our new skills, check out some of the new uh, weapons, and, and battalions that are in the stores and stuff. It'll be a good time all around. But Zita, that's, that's the way here does. You get to just tell two people they're gonna get married. Look, I ship you with Linhart, okay? <laughs> you like spend your clout with the monastery. <laughs> Look, I'm a really famous adventurer, 
girl, and I could ruin your life if you don't marry him, okay? Because I think you're cute together. Well worth the wait, but I probably not a feature I'll be using too much. Uh, but yeah, you see why. But I'm curious about what organizing that shadow library does. I'm guessing it'll just add some more of those like lore books like we have in the library upstairs. But maybe there'll also be some other useful, like there'll be a new quest and or some other uh, loot in it. There's an owl in my room! Oi, shoot! What do you think you just, just because the door's open, you think you can just fly in here and... Oh, whatever. Next video going to the channel is going to be a return to A Dream of the Blood Moon. It was a game we played in our most recent uh, Chill or Be Chilled. That was Chill or Be Chilled 2023. And I really liked it, actually. And we got pretty far in it. I, I had, like, a good shot at beating it, and then I it didn't. Um, so I'm going to give it another go, because I'd really like to try and beat it, because it was I found it a lot of fun, and I liked the art style and the, the, the mechanics of the monster and the all the puzzles and stuff it was just neat i like i had a good time with it so i'd like to i'd like to go back and finish it because we didn't during chill or be chilled next time here we'll be off to the rest of the free days of this month um hopefully i can clear them all in one episode i'll probably be able to hush up for a lot of the fighting because it won't be anything you haven't seen before although i guess all the characters will be having new quotes and stuff so i don't know we'll see I might split it up into two episodes. We'll see. Thank you so very much for coming around to this episode of Legend of Zelda. Fire Emblem Three Houses, actually, is what it is. Our Vern Wind Assassin's only run. Hopefully, I'll see you around. Admiral's gonna be out of here now. Peace! If you're smart, you will heed my advice. Do not pursue this matter any further. Something funny, something is easier said than done in this country. Traps are right by the killers. <laughs> we let Hobby die for this. I'm just guessing Urdiha, or Dihara. Kurain means kill them. Throw this man out. 